Alright, how's everyone doing? Welcome to From Z to A, Alphabetical Interviews with Zach Anderson. I am Zach Anderson. Today we are here at Sage Sound Studios for the 27th edition of Monsters of Acoustic Rock, and I am joined by Jules Byrne. Hello. Hello. So, uh, thank you. Uh, thank you for being on the show. Uh, anytime. So I'm going to uh, ask you the difficult questions as long as they have something to do with the letters of your name. Okay. So we'll start with Jay. Uh, tell me about your musical journey. Uh, how long have you been playing? Uh, what, what, do you have like particular great memories about like your first show perhaps? Oh, well, I started playing like in fifth grade and then it just progressed and I, I stopped playing mm -hmm. and then started playing again and then when I got into high school I started playing seriously and writing my own songs okay. and then performing when I moved up to here uh, in nice. Connecticut um, just little coffee shops and, and yeah, starting out like everybody else. Excellent. Uh, now do you have any uh, uh, specific uh, mu uh, musical plans this year, so like uh, touring or uh, uh, recording? Uh, yeah, like I just got out of the studio, I recorded a brand new EP, like a small collection of songs nice. that should be coming out in like two weeks on Excellent. Arbitrary Phrase Records. So. Sweet. Excellent. Uh, now, when writing songs, do you tend to start with lyrics or music? Uh, does it vary song to song? It varies song to song, but usually what happens is I'll be like watching a movie or a TV show and I'll be like, oh, that'd be a funny song. Mm -hmm. And then I'll like start writing around that. So it's nice. usually lyrics, I guess. Cool. Yeah. Uh, now, is there anything that's essential of you to do before a show? Do you have any uh, pre-show rituals? Uh, not really. Like post-show, I will. Like, I have a specific playlist that mm. I play to like debrief myself right. from show <laughs> mode, you know. But other than that, I, I, I mean, I, I just play and I'm like, don't fuck up. There you <laughs> go. Cool. Uh, now, uh, how do you go about choosing songs for a set list? Uh, do you like plan meticulously out ahead of time, or do you uh, do it on the fly? Uh, I, I plan and then I, I start like a month ahead. And then every day I change the set. So, mm -hmm. so like yesterday I changed my set. So <laughs> I mean, it's always changing. Yeah, I know that is. Now um, I like to end all my interviews with uh, three random or interesting facts about yourself that many people might not know. Okay. Um, number one, uh, I'm a huge Nintendo fan. Okay. I, I'm a, a dork. Uh, Do you have a favorite uh, game or series? Yeah, Legend of Zelda. Perfect. Like, it, Good choice. Perfect. Yes, thank you. <laughs> uh, two, I'm a huge film buff. I mm -hmm. love movies so far. Uh, like it's, yeah. I want it to be my um, my second like right. fallback career. Is a favorite movie? Uh, probably Pulp Fiction. I feel like everybody says that. <laughs> yeah, but like really, uh, Pulp Good choice. Fiction. I mean, yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much for being on the show. Thank you. Um, thank if you, you want to check out. Jules Byrne, please visit the link below, and now we'll cut to a performance from Jules. So, uh, thanks again, and we'll see you next time. I saw you standing in the corner of a smoke-filled room Exchanging glances while I was trying not to stare at you Next to your grandfather's war medals, you were born on a pedestal. Next to your grandfather's war medals, and I love you, but I don't know what to do. The girl with the KK slider tattoo. Romantic and overly melodramatic. That's me. I slip into a panic every time she parts her lips and starts to speak to me. And you've been hanging off every word you said to me. I have been hanging off every word you said to me. Thank you.
Sad